Get ready for a sexy back and flat belly with fitness and lifestyle influencer, Rebecca Louise. We are gonna have an amazing workout today. You're gonna feel incredible and you guys can check out more of my videos on YouTube, Rebecca Louise. So our first exercise, we're just gonna warm up that back. So we're gonna walk down, we're gonna do inchworms. So we're gonna come all the way to the top of your mat. Your hands are gonna be underneath your shoulders, squeeze those hips, tuck under, and then all the way back up. So really stretch out those hamstrings. Ooh. Oh, how good does oh, that, that feel? feels really good. <laughs> so good. So let's just do a couple more, all the way to the end, tucking those hips underneath, and then really push those heels into the ground, keeping your legs nice and straight. Oh, this is definitely part. good if you've done leg day. <laughs> the day before, you're gonna struggle with this one. <laughs> That's it, so squeeze in, and then all the way up to the top, and then when you come up to standing, just tuck those hips underneath to get that little booty burn as well. So yep. all the way down, squeeze. I love that reminder, to squeeze on the plank. So important. Come all the way up to the top. Let's do one more. Okay, let's go. I'm with you, I'm game. Squeeze. <laughs> What's your favorite body part oh, to work out? I'm gonna say it's the abs. The abs, good yeah. job, that's what we're doing today. <laughs> awesome, okay, so we're gonna Not take different. those legs a little bit wider where your, your mat meets the end. We're gonna bend our knees slightly. We're gonna have our hands in front of us and we're gonna squeeze. So we're gonna do those flies, so really working those shoulders. And it doesn't even matter if you don't have any weights, because if you keep your arms nice and strong and tight, mm. you're still gonna get great results. Oh yeah. <sighs> Pinch right between those shoulder blades. Oh yeah, squeeze that together. And if you have weights and you wanna use them, go ahead. I like to use weights as well. Or if you don't, you can even just use water bottles, fill them up with sand or stones. Mm. Actually, that's what I do when I'm away on vacation. <laughs> Creative. Like, yeah, you, ca it's, you can't be packing your weights with nope. you. It's way too much. You've got to have room in your suitcase for everything else. Whew. That's an amazing idea. I'm so doing that next time I travel. Okay, Whew. let's do two more. Squeeze. And one more. Squeeze at the top. And relax oh. down. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, really feeling the burning. Isn't that it way. great? We're gonna come down to the ground and we're gonna do some supermans, or as I like to call them, superwoman. <laughs> okay? Oh yeah. Yeah, so you're gonna bring your arms out in front. Okay, keep your chest up, your head down, and we're gonna squeeze those arms in towards the waist and then out in front. Ooh, oh yeah. That's it, so it's really important you keep your head in line here. Okay. And then can you feel it in your butt too? You can actually, if you squeeze it, you're gonna get a little booty burn in there as well. Whole okay. back side is burning right now. This is awesome. Yeah, this is really great. And you know, so many people actually don't do the right back exercises and it's gonna really help with your posture as well. Absolutely. So no more, you know, with your head down texting and walking into <laughs> lap posts like I do on a regular basis. Oh no. <laughs> okay, squeeze. Let's do two more. Oh my goodness. That's it, lift up that chest a little bit higher. Squeeze, let's just hold it here. That's it, for three, two, one. Now we're gonna bring those arms out in front, okay? And we're gonna take it out to the side and bring it here. Oh my so goodness. that's it, side. It's almost like you're swimming. Yeah, you're trying to stay above water. <laughs> yeah, just making sure that you don't drown. <laughs> yep. I am definitely not very good at swimming, but I'm thinking these exercises might actually make you a little bit stronger. <laughs> Absolutely. I definitely can't do butterfly now. That's a tough one. Whew. That's it. So keep squeezing. That's it. Really inhaling and exhaling. So important when you're doing any exercises to keep breathing. That's going to get the oxygen to your muscles and make sure that you don't faint when you stand up. Oh, that's a good <laughs> thing. That's when you don't. That's when you get you dizzy. You know when you're not breathing. Okay, and squeeze. Let's do one more. And here we go. Okay, so just stretching out that back. Oh, oh wow, yeah. that was intense. All the way down. Oh my so just goodness. Relax that head and then stretch out those arms in front of you. Oh. Isn't this like your favorite part? Yeah. <laughs> They're just Especially breathing. Especially those moves. Oh yeah, there's some tough ones. Okay, we're gonna keep going, Ooh. keep that heart rate up. So we're gonna flip over and we're gonna put those hands directly underneath our shoulders. Okay, okay? and then we're just gonna lift up. Okay, so squeezing those abs Ooh. in, tucking those hips under, and then just lifting one leg up at a time. Oh, you can feel, oh, don't yeah. you feel strong in this move? Like, <laughs> I feel like I can like take over the world. I'm like, yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> I know, almost you can just do like high kicks with it as well. I love it. Oh, That's yeah. it, so keep squeezing. And if you need to, you can come down to your bottom and then just lift up your legs too. But I think everybody needs to just try it try and come up to the those top. Glutes. Cause what's the worst that can happen? It doesn't work the first time, but yeah. you're just gonna get stronger. <laughs> yep. 
Don't you love it when you do a workout and then you do it again like three weeks later and you're so much <laughs> and it's stronger? So much easier, <laughs> yes. This one I'll do a lot because I think the back doesn't get enough attention. And this is just great. I love it. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna come back onto our front <sighs> with our hands underneath. And then we're gonna extend one leg and one arm at a time. If you just wanna do one arm, no problem. So you're gonna bring it out in front here. So you're gonna try and keep everything in line. Now, if you want to, you're gonna lift up that left leg and up and down. So make sure that you keep those hips nice and still. Mm. Okay, you don't want them to kind of twist to either side. Really important, right. you're keeping your belly button facing down to the ground. Woo! Wow. I like it. I like how good. this requires some balance too. <laughs> This is really great for your core. So, you know, we really are doing a, a sexy back and six pack ab workout. Oh, uh, yeah. All in one. Okay, let's change over to the other side. One more. Squeeze. Ooh. And down we go. Okay, lifting up. And like I said, if you just want to do one arm at the front, eventually you're going to be able to lift that leg up at the back once you've got your balance. Really push your hand down into the mat. And then as you lift up, you want to extend that arm out in front of you and that leg back to the back wall. How long do you think you can stay in that pose for if you're balancing oh, at the baby. top? <laughs> It'll start to burn for sure. <laughs> Just that little squeeze of the glute at the top gets those glutes fired up. Love it. Okay, let's do two more on this side. And one more. Ooh. And relax down. Okay, shake out those arms. We're gonna start working those abs. Ready for that? Do it, yeah, okay. I want abs like you, girl. Let's do it. So twist over. We're gonna start with some Russian twists. Okay. You're gonna have your hands out in front of you. We're gonna keep our feet flat on the ground for this one. You can bring it up, but that's gonna activate those uh, quads too. So we're just gonna work on those abs and squeezing those obliques. Is this one of your favorite workouts? Twist. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love the twisting moves too. Really gets those obliques. Ooh. Yeah, it feels like you're like shaving yes. like an inch off at a time. Shaving. <laughs> Now you can also use weights if you have them here. Maybe if you've got a ball, a medicine ball. Uh, you can also, like, I have fun with it being like a partner workout, like throwing the ball yes! to each other like this. Yes! Oh, I love it. It would be like juggling. You could actually like have three going at the same time. <laughs> I think we're gonna have to try that, that's for sure. Next time. <laughs> Next time. Okay, and squeeze. Ooh. And three, two, one. We're gonna roll over onto Ooh. our front and go into a plank. So either on your knees or up on your toes, hands out in front of you, okay? okay? And lift up, tuck your hips underneath, make sure that your head is in line with your butt that's in line with your heels. And then we're just gonna hold here. Oh, that's baby. it, keep squeezing and just breathing. Try and think of something else, <laughs> anything else anything. apart from what you're doing right now, okay? So maybe what you're gonna have for dinner tonight, yeah. where, you, where you're going this weekend, like start to think about that or just listen to my voice because you have just got 10, nine, oh, eight, eight, seven, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. one. Woo. Okay, uh, back onto our back. There's lots of twisting backwards and forwards. A simple plank. I know, simple plank. It can get you every time. It can get you. You don't need these completely complicated <laughs> moves. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do opposite arms. Okay, opposite leg to opposite arm and then squeeze down. Now, if you want to work your abs, okay, if you want to get that six pack ab, it's really important that you squeeze your back so firm onto the ground. If your back starts to come off like this, you just want to put your legs not as low to the ground. Great. I see that oh. all the time. Yeah. <laughs> and then you're just working your back, you're not actually working your abs. Yeah. Oh, this is on fire. I love this move. <laughs> I love it, I love the burn. And you guys can also hashtag, I can feel the burn, Rebecca. And Anna, I'm gonna get yes. you to, to hashtag that afterwards for sure. <laughs> okay, let's go for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna oh. roll up. We're gonna come onto us, onto our knees here. And I know that you like the twisting motion, so you're definitely gonna like this one, Anna. You're gonna bring your arms up to the top. And then we're just going to the side, squeeze and bring it back up again. So it's almost like in hot yoga, you know when you do those like side crescent moves? Yeah. This is really good for opening up your back. Oh yeah. Such a great stretch and a nice crunch. Isn't it? Doesn't it feel so good? Oh, this is a great one to do in the morning as well when you've like just woken up. Mm -hmm. Maybe you've done a few inchworms and then you <laughs> move into this. 
this is definitely going to get you to, to not go back to bed, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, one up. more on this side, and then over to the other side. Ooh. So first of all, lift up, and then squeeze over. So you almost want to think of like squeezing each of those, like each calorie off. That's how I like to think about it. Each inch off. <laughs> squeezing over. And let's go for just a few more on this side. We've got to even it out. Yep. Two and one. You've got one more exercise left to go. Ooh. Let's shake it out. This is one of my favorite ones. This is fun. We're going to have fun with this one. <laughs> so you're going to put your feet either side of your mat. Lie down. You're going to make yourself into a big starfish. Okay. And before <laughs> you relax, we are going to do 10 crunches. So opposite foot to opposite hand. Ready? Let's go. Let's We've just it. got 10. I like to say last set is the best set. Ooh. Ooh. So let's push it through. This is where your body really starts to make the changes when you're pushing nice and hard. Oh yeah. Okay, halfway. Five really to go. Gotta reach. I know. It's helped with your Ooh. flexibility as well, this one. <laughs> okay. Two. Let's do one more. Squeeze it and relax. Oh, oh wow. We're gonna that roll was awesome. up. Let's do a quick stretch on okay. those abs. I think they're gonna need it. That's I do for sure. sure. So you're gonna have your hands underneath your armpits. Your feet are gonna be on the ground. Squeeze your butt, squeeze your feet together, and then just lift up into that cobra. Oh. You can either do it all the way up, oh, yeah, or you can right do it from the hands. either way. It's great just to do them both, get two different She's types of stretches. She's flexible, woo! <laughs> this is a push for my stretch. Oh. I like this though, it Ooh. opens it up. Yeah, for sure. Mm. Three, two, one, and just roll back. Oh. Sit down. Give yourself a pat on the back, or give your neighbor, your partner, oh, a high five. Oh my gosh. Roll back a Louise, she's the real deal.